Hi everyone, my name is Hayley. Thank you for joining me today. This is Bodykind Fitness. Today's workout is going to be a cardio Tabata style workout. So you need to grab a water bottle and get yourself ready. We're gonna be doing some really, really good cardio work today. For Tabata, what we do is we're gonna do 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest, and we're gonna do that for eight times in four rounds. So are you ready to do this? Let's get to it. Right guys, let's get going because this is going to be our 20 minute Tabata workout. So start, we're going to warm up our body just very quickly. So give me a nice shoulder roll here. If you want a longer warm up, then please do press pause, do a little warm up for yourself and then press play again when you're ready. This is going to be a nice short one so we can get into it today. Give me some reaches overhead. That's it. Good job. And reach across. Excellent. And give me some hamstring curls. So like I said in the introduction, this is a Tabata style workout. So Tabata is 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. Give me step touch. And that might not sound like much, but believe me, those 20 seconds of work go quick, but the 10 seconds of rest go even quicker. So we will be working that cardio this morning. So. I hope you're feeling up for it. Of course you are. We've got this. <laughs> Lovely. Give me some more shoulder rolls to the front. Lovely. And then a couple more arm reaches. And just give me some reaches down here. Take half step, step, step. Reach again. Step, step, step. Just to get that stretch there in the back of those calf muscles. Good job. One more. And stay here and give me some bum kicks here. Lovely. Feeling warm? Getting there? Perfect, give me a nice deep breath in. And out again. And let's get ready to do this. So, our Tabata workout today is gonna to be broken down into four rounds. So each round is gonna have two different moves in it. So I'm gonna preview those moves for you. We are then gonna be working 20 seconds on, 10 seconds rest. We're gonna do that eight times per round. In between each round, there's gonna be a minute's rest. So that's when you're gonna be able to compose yourself, grab some water, obviously grab water at any point in the workout. If you want to just complete, completely take a rest during that minute, then do. If you wanna stay here and do a step touch, then that's great too. This is your workout, you do your levels. <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna preview the first two moves for you and then we'll get into our first round. Feeling good, awesome. So our first move is that we're gonna stand like this and we're gonna be doing a knee repeater. So the knee comes right across, just like that. Perfect. And we'll be doing that for 20 seconds on one side, 10 seconds rest, 20 seconds on the other. And then we'll be doing the switch on the same side. After that, our second move of this round is gonna be a punch across our body. So we're swiveling right here and then we're coming back with the other knee and lifting across the body so we're really getting a nice twist there in our torso from all angles and again we'll be alternating the sides per move perfect let's get ready for round one right get ready guys three two one we're going into that knee repeater so bring me a nice driving knee here your arm is reaching down and coming down your hip all the weight is on this standing leg so you'll start to feel that burnout as well excellent keep it going in three two one hold it here rest take a deep breath we're going over to the other side now okay you ready weight in the standing leg let's get ready to go in three two one same again but this side so that knee is driving through Feel that crunch in your tummy too. Halfway, guys. Excellent. Three, two, one. Hold it here, take a breath. We're now going into our second move of this round, which is the punch across the body and bringing across for a, a knee there. Ready to go? One, let's go. So punch, knee, punch, knee. You're swiveling 
on this standing leg help giving you momentum and intention with that punt. Three, two, one. You've got it, same on this side now. Take that breath. Get ready to swivel. Go. Three, there we go. Halfway. Three, two, one. Hold it here. We're going back now. So we've done half of this round. Back to those knee repeaters now on this side. Ready, weight in that standing leg, let's go. Push that knee through. It's a driving knee. So it should be coming forward. Excellent. You've got it. Three, two, one. Excellent. And then the other side. Weight on this leg. In three, two, one. Let's go. Three, two, one. Hold it here. Two goes left. And this is on the crossbody punch. So get ready to swivel. Three, two, one. Punch, knee. Punch, knee. This is a real heart rate riser, right? Three, two, one. One more, go on. <laughs> Take a deep breath. Final go for this round on this side. So, ready, cross body punch. Let's go. One, two, three, four. You've got it. Halfway. Three, two, one, excellent. Let's take a breather. So we have a minute here. So what I want you to do with this minute is if you can and you feel up for it, keep marching on the spot. If you want to take a seat and grab a drink, do. But of course, the more you keep going, it's going to keep that heart rate up a little bit more. So when we go into our next round, you're raring to go. So take some sips of water. Let me just preview the next moves for you now. So watch this as we go. So for our next two moves for our round, our round two, we're going to start with a skater. So, if you want some impact, we're jumping and our arms are coming out here and going around. If you want to take the impact out with step, touch, step, touch, step, touch. So we're doing a skater. And then our second move for this round is some kicks. So what I want you to do is hold a guard up here and we'll be kicking our legs out in front of us, bracing that core. You can almost feel a slight crunch there. So when you're ready, in three, two, one, let's go with the skaters. So, we're either here with the skater for 20 seconds. If you want step touch, we're step touching. Wherever you're comfortable, remember this is your workout. Keep going guys, looking really strong. Three, two, one, excellent, hold it here. Let's get ready to go into those kicks. So give me a nice hip width apart. Hold that hand on that guard. Three, two, one, let's kick it out. Think about crunching. You've really got to get that breath in those 10 seconds because it goes quick, right? <laughs> Halfway, guys. Keep kicking. Take that breath we can, don't forget to breathe. Three, two, one, hold it here, rest. Deep breath in and back to those skaters. So when you're ready, let's get ready to go in three, two, one. Here we go. Three, 
Halfway. Three, two, one. Hold it here. And let's get ready to go back into those kicks. Guard up. Three, two, one. Kick, 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 kick. Tabata is no joke, am I right? But the good thing is, is there's four rounds and in 20 minutes you are done. Three, two, one, hold it here, rest. So we're halfway through round two. Let's kill it on the other half. So we're going back to those skaters. Three, two, one, let's go. Three, two, one. Hold it here. Get ready to do those kicks. Give me a nice roll of the shoulders quickly. Deep breath in. And let's kick it out. Three, two, one. Kick, kick, kick. If you lean back, you'll sort of brace that core even more for those kicks. Just to add a little bit of extra work. <laughs> In three, two, one, hold it here. Each move once more, and then round two is done. <laughs> Excellent. Let's go to the skater. Three, two, one, let's go. Don't forget to breathe. Breathing throughout is so important. It's easy when you're concentrating on a move to hold your breath. But you need oxygen. Go into those muscles. So keep it going. Three, two, one. Excellent, hold it here. And let's get ready to go into those kicks for the final time. Guard up. You've got this. Looking really strong. Three, two, one, kick. Halfway. Crunch, crunch. Three, two, one. Oh, take that moment to breathe in. Grab some water. So, let me preview our round three moves. We're on round three already, guys. I mean, I wasn't kidding when I said it went quick, right? So round three, we're doing some star jacks. So with this, your arms coming up in the sky. We're going down and up, down and up. Very low impact. So anyone that's suffering with any joint problems or you're trying to keep it quiet for people around you, we're going all the way down and up, back in. So no jumping. And our second move, we're doing a quick jab, jab, squat. So bending it all the way back. Quick, quick, down. It's quick. It's gonna raise that heart rate. But you'll be feeling really good after it. <laughs> So take a nice deep breath in, roll those shoulders. Let's get ready to work for round three. Three, two, one. Arms up, down to those star jacks. Halfway already. Three, two, one. Excellent. Rest it out. Let's get ready to go into those jab, jab squats. So fairly quick. Bend down. Three, two, one. Jab, jab, squat. Jab, jab, squat. You've got it. Push that bum back behind you. All the weight is going into those heels. You should feel that heart rate rising. I am outside. It's November and I'm sweating. So, I expect you are too. Right, rest it here. Lovely. So we're going back to those star jacks now. Three, two, one, and down, up, down, up. Whew. 
leg is going all the way out to the side. If you want to modify, just don't go as far. But obviously, the further you go, the more it's going to work. Last one, rest it here. Good job. Back into those jab, jab squats. Legs hip width apart. Three, two, one. Jab, jab, squat. Jab, jab, squat. Halfway. Guys, we have one more round after we finish this round. Three, two, one. There we go, rest it out. So, we're doing that all over again, and then round three is done. <laughs> So let's go back to those star jacks, arms up and down. down. Halfway. Three, two, one. Rest it out. Let's get ready to jab, jab, squat. You are looking so strong and you've got this. Let's go. Jab, jab, squat. Jab, jab, squat. <sighs> Guys, never underestimate the power of mind over matter. Your mind tells you can do this and your body will follow. You've got it. Last one, rest it here. Believe me, you are getting so strong by keeping with this. Take the breaks when you need it, but when you're ready, three, two, one, let's go back. Star jab. You are a star. Don't forget it. Three, two, one. Last one of those. Back into our jab jab squat for the last time. But we've got it. Three, two, one. Jab, jab, squat. Jab, jab, squat. Halfway. Three, two, one. And rest. Right, we're back for our minute rest. Grab that water, guys. What are you feeling? You still here? Please stay. <laughs> One round left. Lovely. So our final round, I want you to watch these moves carefully. So we're doing inchworm, and then we're going to squat, lunge, squat. So we're finishing on the big guns. Okay, so with an inchworm, starting right here, we're going down to our toes. We're walking our hands out into a sort of a press up. Come back, up, and up again. And then for our squat, so we're going into a curtsy lunge, into a squat in the middle, and then a curtsy lunge on the other side. So, do them at your own pace, but just remember we are doing 20 seconds of each, and then we're resting for 10 in between. And you've so got this to finish this workout really strong now. So three, two, one. Let's go into that inchworm, so we're reaching up, down to our toes, walk it out, give me a nice push up here, and then back, and up. And if you don't want to push up, we're walking out, and we're just walking back. Up again. Three, two, one. Come back and rest. Lovely, and we'll get ready to go into those curtsy lunges and squats. Legs hip width apart. We're taking a curtsy lunge, so your leg is going up behind you, coming back into a center squat and then to a curtsy lunge as well. Curtsy lunge is exactly what you think it is. Almost like doing a curtsy. <laughs> but you'll feel the power building in those legs. Excellent, three, two, one, rest it here. Let's get ready to go back into that inchworm now. If you want the optional press up halfway through, go for it. If not, you know your levels. Three, two, one, walk it down to those toes. Get out, push up, and back, and up. 
reach to the sky, down to the toes, out, down. We can squeeze one more in, guys. Three, two, one, and rest. Excellent. Going back into that squat lunge. Curtsy lunge squat. It gets to you, these tabatas. So let's go. Curtsy lunge. Hot. Into squat, halfway there. Excellent. Good job, guys. Three, two, one. Hold it here. So, we have done half of round four. You've got two of each move left, and then we're done. Let's go into it. Three, two, one. Let's inch one that out. So, down to those toes. Walk it all the way out. Press and back up. Remember, those modifications, you go to whatever level you are comfortable with. Three, two, one. I know I'm making you do a little bit extra on that inch worm. Good job. Right, back down. Three, two, one. Let's curtsy lunge and squat. Curtsy lunge. Good job. Every time you do this, you are going to get stronger and stronger and it will fall easier and easier. Three, two, one, up we can. One more of each and we're finished. And you are going to finish strong because I know you can. Three, two, one, let's go. We can fit one more of these in, and then that is done. Three, two, one, rest. Excellent. And our last time now for a curtsy lunge squat. Curtsy lunge. Three, two, one. Here. Finish it strong, guys. Give me a smile. You are more than halfway down of this. Oh, <laughs> back to the lip. Give me one more each side and we are done. One more. And squat it down. Well done. Give yourselves a round of applause. Take a nice big sip of water and a deep breath. Maybe take the deep breath first and then sip water. No one anyone joking. <laughs> Good job. Right, let's cool ourselves down. Give me a nice roll of the shoulders here. Oh, step touch, step touch. How are you feeling? Do you feel good? Yeah, I hope so. I hope you enjoyed that. It's something a little bit different from the walking workouts, but it's an excellent cardio boost. It's really gonna push you. And like I said, each time you do it, you should be able to do one more rep. We'll feel that a little bit stronger. Lovely. Hold it here. Let's do those reaches. Tap, tap, tap. Reach, tap, tap, tap. Oh, feel that in those hamstrings. We've really worked them today. Excellent. And when you're ready, let's hold it this side. Oh, reach down to that toe. Oh. Guys, please do like and subscribe to my channel. If you liked this, give me a comment below and let me know what you liked. If there's anything you didn't like, or if there's anything you want to see more of, let's switch our leg. I'm all ears. And if you're over on Instagram, I'm over there. So do feel free to, um, to pop over there. And let's start the conversation going about all things fitness related. Let's pull that quad stretch right there if you need to hold on to something then do. How are you guys feeling all about Christmas coming up? It's a month to go. Well less than that actually isn't it? Yeah, less than a month. I could start panicking right about now. <laughs> but I won't. 
Excellent. Right, give me some torso twists here. Whew. Breathe in. Feel super proud about what you have just achieved. That is no easy workout, and you have done it. And you finish strong. Lovely. Come here. Give me a nice stretch right here. What's your favourite thing about working out? I always love this moment here, especially when you just feel so good. You have endorphins sort of rushing around your body. You clasp your hands behind your back and pull down for me. And my stretch across the shoulders and that chest. Yeah, I just love this after bit where you know you've got it done. You feel really good. Those endorphins are racing around feel really positive. So, hope you guys do too. Push those arms forward. Feel that stretch across those shoulders. Lovely. Feet together. And I'll see you for the next workout, guys. Take care. Bye.